Good day, members. Greg Florimo here. I thought I'd just say good day as part of this week's Grizzly News and give you a bit of an update on what season 2022 looks like for the Bears. Obviously, 2021 was a tough one, not much happening on the footy front, but we've been active here at the back office. I want to talk you through and walk you through our new facility or our upgrade facility and talk to you a bit about our new teams because in season 2022 we're going to have two new teams. We're going to have our under-19s Tasha Gale women's team which is running at this stage concurrently with the SG Ball competition, nine games against many of the other NRL clubs uh, around Sydney. So that's a really, really strong inclusion for the Bears and then obviously there's the Lisa Fiola Cup team, which is an under-17s uh, girls competition, and that will be run over a weekend, uh, yet to be determined. So those two additions to our team, to our club, means that we've got to make room for them and make sure it's as professional an environment as possible, and that they're learning and that they are getting fitter at every possible moment. Come on in. So compared to what this place is gonna look like in a few weeks' time, at the moment it's quite bare and quite barren, but it is a great facility for our players to be able to come in here and do their weights. Um, in particular, they can see the physio at the same time, they can do a little bit of coaching. Um, so the plans are for this facility, obviously you can see our frameworks here, uh, where we'll do our bed and a lot of the uh, heavy lifting around this area. Um, and we'll, we'll flow that on all the way down that wall, um, with brand new matting on, on the wall and there will be some uh, dumbbells along there, some other benches and, and different weight machines. A cardio corner down in the back corner with, with some pulleys and some rowing machines there at the moment. Um, and as, as we move around, we'll have a little section for the physio down at the, the back end and the coaches. And anywhere from that point forward is going to be where the hard work needs to be done. We'll put our platforms that need to go back down here um, and this is where the guys really live with the, the big big weights and the girls obviously so it's a great facility we're really excited about how it's going to look I must say that some of this equipment um, brings a personal um, touch to me we've actually used some of this stuff back when I was playing in the mid 90s so uh, it's still very functional and, and, and very good for lifting lifting heavy weights so um, that's the gym, can't wait to get started, hopefully it's not far off. Look after yourself members, look forward to seeing you soon.